You're watching CES Live, powered by Ustream.tv, the most powerful way to stream live video, and by Utech, makers of the TriCaster family of broadcast and streaming systems. And now, CES Live. Hey everyone, we are here at CES Live. I'm Renee Ritchie. And I'm Serenity Caldwell. And we are going to be talking about amazing Apple and related products all day. And who better to talk about it with than Sadio? Hi Sadio. How are you? <laughs> so we've got uh, Kevin. Kevin, right? And hey. Derek. Sorry, I've got Hi, CES Kevin. brain, I apologize. Hey. No problem. <laughs> so did I say Sadio right? Yes. yes. All yes. right, oh, good. four years Too of my nail it. <laughs> I know. All right, so uh, every year I come here and I, and I say, I have seen enough cases. There is nothing that anyone could do in a case anymore that I haven't seen. And then I see your booth, and you make me eat my words every <laughs> year. <laughs> yes. Yeah. So, let's uh, let's talk about what you guys brought to the uh, the show this year. All right. What's on this table? Um, I guess you want to talk about Tetra. Pro? Yeah. Yeah. So we have a new case uh, this year. We started out actually with the uh, the Tetra, which actually is a metal bumper. Uh, there's a TPU inner part, and then uh, outer part is actually machined What's aluminum. What's TPU for those people who aren't familiar with it? Tetra. Poly, oh, it's a chemical uh, thing. It's, yeah, a yeah, science. Yeah. Science, it's science, guys. Yeah. Science. Yeah, and uh, we're actually introduced. This one's actually been on the market for a little while now. We're actually introducing a Tetra Pro. So a lot of our customers asked. They wanted the back covered. They didn't want it to be scratched up because they have their nice iPhones. They don't want uh, to so destroy it. So walk us through this because we saw a lot when the iPhone 4 came out. We saw a lot of bumpers. What do you think that was? Is that just people wanted to be minimal? Yes. Yeah. They, you know, Apple does a lot of work for the designs to make it look beautiful and people want to show that off, but they don't want to risk it dropping and, and destroying okay. the phone. So what we want to do is, is make the clear back so that you can still see your device and still enjoy it, but have it protected as well. Yeah, because with the bumpers, you would still get the scratches on the back, and some people like the pristine look. Yes, yes, and that's why we also went with the aluminum, so that we have a little bit of that, um, the same design that yeah. they had. Well, I mean, this is all blinged out in gold, right? This looks as Cardassian as an iPhone does. There you go. Is that so? Are, are matching the aesthetics of the products increasingly important? Uh, I think so. People really wanted, you know, like I said, keep with the design that Apple put out there. So we wanted to give them what they've been asking for. <laughs> nice customer satisfaction and service, folks. That's yeah. the way to do it. Well, I know um, I don't have a Sadio case on right now, but I uh, I ended up getting a clear case because I do like seeing the gold on my iPhone. Yes. So that's that's a pretty cool way to do it. I yeah. think. Yeah. Yeah, and we definitely we matched every single color of the iPhone. So we have every colored iPhone. Of course, we have black, yeah. and additionally red and blue, just because some people like. So you all show off the colors a little bit. For People sure. kept telling me every year, black, you know, everyone says they want variety, but everyone still buys black. Is that true. still true? Very yes. true, very That's true. true. <laughs> People, people, if you want more colors, you got to buy more colors. This is an intervention. This is me to you, right here. <laughs> Please buy, buy some reds so I can have more red cases. I do love them so. So what else have you got for us? Uh, another case we have is uh, we came out with our waterproof case. Uh, we have it for the, both the iPhone 6 and iPhone 6 Plus. Uh, I guess we can do a little mini. Oh, unboxing. Yeah. A mini unboxing, unboxing here for you guys. Let's do it. <laughs> So basically, this is for the 6 Plus. plus. Renee, very, give very me your phone. Oh, nice. <laughs> oh, it comes absolutely. with an audio adapter, of course, so you can, if you have waterproof headphones, and you can definitely use it. Um, okay. And quick, easy opening, and no tools required or anything. You don't even really need a quarter. Some people use it. If they don't have like fingernails at all, they could do it. But as you can see, I open it pretty easily with my fingers. You're a pro. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe that. And really easy installation. You just put the phone in. Now, and when you say snip. waterproof, is this like shower, bathtub, oh, or can I actually go in the pool with this? This is uh, actually up to two meters, 30 wow. minutes. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, this is actually waterproof, waterproof, so. Swimming with sharks, waterproof. Yes, pretty good, waterproof. And then we can move there. Nice. And everything is just good. Look at that. Even like a fingerprint scanner still works and everything. It looks like a Galaxy Note now, folks. Take it out. Yes. <laughs> it's so fancy. Also has the military drop test on there. Shall I? Go for it. Wow. Right. <laughs> No. Well, the <laughs> one involves military tanks. one involves a yeah, a little bit more droppage, Renee. Yeah, a little bit more droppage. Yeah, little uh, bit rail more guns, rail guns and mass drivers. Yeah, I might have to like toss this. I'm not Curly would not your catch phone, it. <laughs> such a jerk. Oh no, we just throw it at Dave's head. So and this is a fully encapsulated. All the buttons are are yep. covered. Uh, and so and you said there's a little attachment for the speak for the. Uh, yes, there's a little attachment that you can. If you have waterproof headphones and you're at the beach or anything, you still don't. You want to listen to music, but you're not afraid that you're going to hurt your phone or anything. Just put it in, and then you twist. It's like anime yeah. battle armor. <laughs> it is. <laughs> and then your phone is going to be perf fully protected from like anything, 
any water at all, even when you listen to music and everything. You can't sneak through that headphone port. Nope, it's not going to go through. There's it. some hilarious yeah. guy in the chat it's room asking good. if it bends. <laughs> if it bends? The case does bend. Yes, the case will bend by itself. Uh -huh. By itself will bend. It's pretty good. <laughs> oh, no, John Pazlidis wants to show. Yeah, yeah John he wants to show me what a big phone really mm -hmm. is. Whoa. Hi, John. <laughs> Folks, there's not an eclipse in Las Vegas right now. It's just John and his phone. Oh, yep. He's hiding back there. Hi, John. <laughs> That's fa So are, are waterproof cases getting more popular now? Do more people want them? Yeah, I think yeah. they are. Um, so. What we're doing is making it really, really sleek, and I think that's why they're getting more popular because people are not having to put it, make it a tank like you were saying, and uh, they can have the sleek uh, design that Apple put out there, but still get the protection for think, water. I think there's also there's this kind of movement towards fitness and health, like, like we have the health app, and everyone has tracking their steps, and maybe they want to go jogging in the rain, and they don't want to leave their phone behind because they're using that to track their their fitness. Certainly, Absolutely. and actually glad that you asked because we have a holster combination that goes on, and then it yep. can go on an armband, or it can go on a car mount, or a bike mount. We can actually use that with our Quest mounting. System. Georgia and Anthony were rocking the holsters all the way through CES. It looked almost para <laughs> almost paramilitary. <laughs> right on their sides, click the phone was in their hand, and they were back in business. It was oh amazing. yeah, Georgia was fun. She was a little skeptical at first about the holster, and then by the end okay. of it, she was, she was so, no, all there, about it. There was it. an original image of uh, holsters being for Blackberry guys, right? Like Wall Street Blackberry types of holsters. Yeah. But now I think it's for active people. Yes, yeah. exactly. It's very convenient. Yeah, they're out from behind their desk and they're enjoying their lives. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> so you had some, oh, pink as well. Yeah, we have to like, just show you like the size. It's not really, it doesn't add much bulk compared to, you know, just like your naked phone. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Adds enough so it uh, gives you a drop protection, but still gives you a sleek and design. A little bit of character, a little yeah. bit of personality. But definitely, mm -hmm. we're trying to do a little more Freeman clientele with a little pink here and there. Now, let me be honest with you for a second. I, I stopped taking my the iPhone 6 Plus is big enough that I stopped taking my iPad Mini with me. But the problem I had is I had the iPad Mini in a in a stand-up case, and I would just put it on the drop table and watch it. The iPhone I had to hold. So immediately I got here, I saw the kickstand case, and I said yes, <laughs> because now when I'm on the airplane, kick the stand open, put it on the tray, sit back, relax. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, we have like the metal me metallic kickstand for almost all of our, almost all of our cases now. Yep. So it helps you know if you can see it just you can watch movies easily, especially on the plane, and everything. Makes it really well, nice. What I really appreciate about this kickstand is that it's fairly unassuming. Like when I look at this case from the back, and I can even put it on this here, right? This doesn't look like a kickstand. It doesn't really bulk out of the case all that much. There's a little bit of a bump, but not really. It just looks like fancy Sadio branding. And then when you just pop it up. Bomb. Then it becomes a kickstand, which I I just I, I'm not a huge fan of oh the big bulky kickstand. So yeah. having it being nice and sleek, I think, is really and awesome. No offense to Microsoft, I like my kickstands being optional. I want them on for certain <laughs> periods of time, exactly. and I want them off on other periods of time. I don't need the perma kick. Okay. Yeah, <laughs> exactly. Can I can I can I hashtag trademark that hashtag perma, -kick? perma kick hashtag perma kick. I think you should stick to reporting, Renee. Uh, <laughs> you got a lot of great colors back there too. Yeah, yeah. So we're offering a lot of different colors now. This one's actually our uh, blue for the capsule case. And this one's actually kind of unique that you can actually, it's a screen protector door. Nice. So it takes out the hassle of actually installing a screen protector. Just close it, forget it, everything still works between there and you can use your touch ID, your speaker, everything is still good. And you have even more protection around the rim. Uh, it's and so the thin, it looks bigger on the inside. You had to make it because it was blue, right? Yes. <laughs> and we have a lot of different colors, purple, orange, red. Red. Uh, red, <laughs> yeah. Blue, I'm black, of course, of is, is still the, the fan favorite. There's one there that I know my sister's going to love because she has always rocked the wallet case, and when she went to the iPhone 6, she didn't have one yet. Okay. Oh. Yeah, this is actually our, our ledger case. So it actually has a magnet here that'll keep it closed when you're not uh, in use. Then you can actually open it. Here's a credit card slot yep. for you to put in an ID, credit card, anything you can think of. And then the case would just go in right here. What's great about this is it can actually be used as a kickstand. It's trifold. Oh, look at that. And then you can also rotate it and do portrait as oh. well. Oh, <laughs> nice. And then we also had some people complain that they couldn't access the volume button, so you can go one more, some <laughs> people, <laughs> satisfying as many po people as possible. The Olympic gymnastics community just gave you a nine for that. <laughs> oh. The complete fit rotation. <laughs> complete fit rotation. <laughs> Yeah. So, Ren, what do you think? What are you leaning towards for your iPhone next? Hmm. You know, I don't have a good waterproof case, and I feel like, so I play roller derby, which is not very water related, but I do end up dropping. Impact my, related. Yes, exactly. <laughs> and I end up coaching with my phone a lot. And as you can see, the case I have on my phone right now is very pretty. It's, it has stars on it. But um, in terms of drop protection, I even have a crack right here. It's not uh. not very uh, not very sturdy. So I might have to look into getting one of those yeah. waterproof. You would have it if you cases. had the waterproof. Yeah. <laughs> she she yeah. may have run over it with her skates once or twice. 
Not this one. Not this the one. last one. The last one. <laughs> Apple, I take very good care of my phones. Please don't take them away from me. <laughs> sorry, not sorry. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so what's coming up from Sadio for 2016, for 2015 this year? 2015. 2015. 2015. Goes so fast. It is the yes, future. It's already. Yes, it does. Um, at this year, um, we're pretty much going to go ahead and going to try to produce as more of these. People are really interested in these metal bumper cases because it's really, a lot of people still like their sleek, you know, because phones are getting bigger and bigger. I mean, there's going to be, there's of course, there's going to be outdoorsy who love the waterproof. But if you're like in the office all the time, people really like the sleek. So we're going to go ahead and uh, try to produce more of these metal bumper cases with these clear backs as more people like these design, like phone designers are coming out better and better looking phones that people want to show off. Yeah. So. We're also looking into more of these style cases where people can show them off. You, you guys are great because on some of your ranges you manage to hide the logo but still make the phone look better. <laughs> yes. <laughs> awesome. Like and are you seeing any sort of trends the way fashion is going? Is it more metallic? Is it more bright colors? Is it more patterns? What do people What do people want from you these days? What do you want from them? We get a lot of requests for the bright colors and everything, but kind of like what we talked about earlier, people still gravitate it's back to the black. It's a little black jacket, a little black dress. Yeah. It's a classic. <laughs> Black. I mean, I do, I do love the black, but it's kind of fun to decorate up your uh, your phone a little bit, right? You, you have a little bit of style to it. Let's be honest. So, <laughs> sorry, go ahead. Oh, no, I was saying the chat the chat room wants you to make cases for Windows phones. They're very sad. <laughs> we'll work on buy that. A, <laughs> buy a ton of Windows phones. Yes, they exactly. will hear you. Yes. We'll Just look like into <laughs> it. We'll look into it. Uh, the, the other thing that's really cool, I totally lost my train of thought, Ren. I'm so sorry. I think no. it was all my fault. No, not at all. <laughs> no, I was going to say that you know, it, if you want the black case, you can buy more than one case. People are talking about wearables now with different watch bands. The phone is the same thing. You can have your phone and you can have your party case and your work case. The, the, the black case is what I wear to the office, but as soon as I'm out at night, it's the pink case, baby. You know, you can really accessorize. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, we you got guys a lot don't of mind. to uh, <laughs> you don't mind. <laughs> to make it really easy to get the cases on and off, make it easier to put things on. Like our dual layer case is actually just to pop in now instead of having to put things on. So, and the waterproof you saw was really easy, so. Mm -hmm. The changing things in and out is becoming a lot more easy, more yeah. accessible. I appreciate that, and I also appreciate that you keep them relatively affordable. So it's a nice sort of double whammy. Oh, awesome. So people, and, and they also make a full line of Android cases, right? Like Definitely. Yeah, correct. Correct. yeah, these are all available. For, well, as you can know, this is actually a No. 4, and that's also a No. 4 as yeah. well. Awesome. Yeah. yeah, so you don't you don't have to have an iPhone. You, know, you can make Apple cry and get an Android phone and still get a wonderful Sadio case. Mm -hmm. uh, if people are interested and they want to find out more information, where can they go? SadioOnline.com. That's so easy. Yep. SadioOnline.com, get the black case and something else. Your yeah. fashion advisor, me, insists. Spice yeah. up your life, internet. Spice up your life. All right, thank you so much, guys. That was absolutely fabulous. Yeah. Thank, thank you, you Kevin. Thank you, Derek. <laughs> absolutely. Ren, I'm going to go get a plethora of cases. A plethora? A plethora. I've oh. decided plethora is the right number for me. OK. And we're going to have a plethora of more segments coming up for you very soon. To Serenity Caldwell. And Renee Ritchie. Renee Ritchie, CES Live. We'll be right back. Bye-bye.